After I was taught to make chicken this way, I don't want to do it any other way, it looks amazing and delicious, I'm sure you'll love it. I'll start by adding a pound of chicken in a pan, but if your pan fits more than a pound of chicken, you can add more to it as much as you want. Once the chicken is added, I'm going to add 400 milliliters of milk, but it must be at room temperature. Then I'm going to season the chicken, adding a teaspoon of salt, a teaspoon of oregano, a tablespoon of garlic powder. And once added these seasonings, I will take the pan to the stove over medium heat, cover it and let it cook for 13 minutes, or until the chicken absorbs the milk. While the chicken is cooking, in a bowl, I will add 2 eggs and 50 milliliters of milk. And I will mix very well, to incorporate the eggs with the milk. Guys this recipe with chicken that we are making, is very easy to make and they are very crunchy, I am sure everyone will like the result. After 15 minutes cooking the chicken, I will uncover it and check if it is ready, as you can see friends, the chicken has already consumed all the milk, I will remove it from the stove, and let it rest for a few minutes to cool. To what the chicken is cooling, in a refractory, I will add half a cup of bread crumbs, and half a cup of wheat flour, but we must add the same amount of both flour and bread crumbs. Now I'm going to season it by adding a teaspoon of salt, a teaspoon of garlic powder, a teaspoon of chimichurri, a teaspoon of oregano, a teaspoon of paprika powder, a pinch of black pepper, and I will mix everything very well. At this moment I would like to know, from which country or city you look at us, to send you a special greeting in the next recipe. The greeting in today's recipe is for Maria Mercy from Philippines, also for Jackie Daniel from Nigeria, and Rose Marie from Jamaica. Thank you for always seeing and enjoying our recipes. When the chicken has cooled, I will first pass it through the mixture of milk and eggs, which I had reserved. Then I'm going to go through the mixture of bread crumbs and wheat flour, which I also had reserved. If you have come this far seeing today's recipe, that means that you are liking this recipe. So leave us here below the following message, I love chicken, to send you a very special greeting. And in this way we should have the chicken well breaded. Then, in a pan I have enough oil, to fry our chicken over medium heat, but I will only add a few pieces, so as not to change the temperature of the oil, because if we add many pieces the oil will cool. I assure you friends that you will like this fried chicken, it is very simple and easy to make, my family loves it because it is very crispy and soft. And already our crispy and tasty chicken is ready, look how incredible it has been, I recommend doing it at home, but I would like you to rate this recipe, from 0 to 10, to know if you liked the result. Thank you for watching this recipe until the end, I hope you liked the result. Tell me if it's the first time, you see one of my recipes. And if so, don't forget to subscribe on YouTube as, Recipes Oni, and activate the bell so you can always receive our recipes. A hug and see you in the next recipe.